So David's son, Absalom, is, is orchestrated this coup attempt, and it's been successful. David's fleeing for his life, and David says this, how long will you people ruin my reputation? How long will you make groundless accusations? How long will you continue your lies? Like, nothing can steal your peace faster than people, right? Yeah. Turn to somebody, wherever you are, and say, uh, it's not you. <laughs> it's not you. But people can steal. And COVID's not the only thing that people are panicking about. And it's not the only thing that's contagious. I tell you, the most contagious thing right now is panic. Like, if, talk to people, and they're like, 2020 is the worst year ever. I just can't wait for this year to be over. It's just been awful. Well, you know, I'm glad we hang out, hung out today. This was great. I'm so encouraged. But they, they can't find anything good. But as the people of God, we're like, no, I'm looking for the good. Where's God working? What is God doing? How, how are things working in my favor? We fight for that. And when David fled, listen to this, when David fled, he didn't flee alone. He had 600 men that were devoted to him and they fled with him. And ultimately, these were the men who helped him regain the throne. Write this down. Not only can I press, uh, press on in peace through prayer, but I can press on in peace when I press into God's people. I can press on in peace when I press into God's people. Who are you surrounding yourself with? Who are you listening to? Like who has, who has your ear? 